man is in jail tonight in connection with making threatening calls to a school and a news outlet earlier this week. MTM's John Amy has all the details. 8 Butte man known for openly carrying firearms is in jail this week after police allege he made intimidating phone calls to Kennedy Elementary School and the NBC News station in Butte. Police allege 21-year-old Andrew James was upset about a news story he appeared in concerning a lockdown at the school last week. He swore at the person that was uh, either on the answer machines or on the person who was uh, answering the call, called them vulgar names, uh, you know, said that he might stop by their businesses. He didn't threaten them, he just said that he may stop by, which to these people, of a person carrying guns stopping by the school or stopping by the, the, the station uh, would, would put, put fear into them. On the afternoon of March 2nd, someone called the Kennedy School here on Emmett Avenue to report there was a man with a gun walking in the area. So the principal put the school on temporary lockdown and then notified police. We're always on the alert for any kind of thing, any kind of uh, danger. So we take this seriously and that's why we did the lockdown. After police conducted investigation, they determined that Andrew James did not actually walk by the school, but he was found at the shooting range behind Big Butte. Police say they often get calls from concerned citizens who see James walking down the street with his firearms. Now, in Montana, it's perfectly legal to open carry firearms in public, so he's not breaking any laws. However, police say people should always call them if they see something that appears suspicious. We encourage the people to call on stuff like that because it, uh, on, if they see something that they're uh, they don't think is right, give us a call and we'll check it out. And our officers, have, you know, we make contact, like I said, we make contact with them several times on this, on this stuff and he's never been overtly threatening to us or anybody at, uh, uh, during that time, during the times we checked on him. John Amy, MTN News in Butte. James Faust uh, faces two felony counts and remains in jail tonight on a $25,000 bond.